When it comes to Minecraft PvP, getting a combo or hitting your opponent multiple times in a row is almost essential to actually winning the duel. There are many different ways to start a combo, but most common are using projectiles like fishing rods, or eggs, snowballs, and sometimes even a bow. However, in the popular minigame Bed Wars, you can't obtain a fishing rod, and bows are super expensive as well as eggs. So the only item that is actually worth getting to start a combo would be the snowball, or bed bug, a silverfish. And conveniently, they were recently reduced to only cost 30 iron instead of the original 40. I think you can tell where this is going, but in this video I'm gonna try and combo Bedwars players using a silverfish. I hope you enjoy. Before I could start comboing kids with silverfish and ruining all their hopes and dreams, I had to get my first rush out of the game, so I threw down a quick bed defense and then I started building up to blue. As I was bridging up to get to blue base, blue decided to counter my attack and bridge up as well. Now usually this would be a bad thing, but because I'm actually awesome at this game, I was able to hit them off when they jumped for me and was then able to break their bed. After I broke their bed and they respawned, I went in for the final kill. They didn't put up much of a fight, but whatever. Now I was able to buy my silverfish to combo people, but who would I use it on? The answer to that question is this guy right here. He came over to where I was and I decided to fight him. I threw some bed bugs at him, but ultimately, I lost. Was this it? Was I defeated? Is bed bugs not a good combo method? Are you kidding me? Of course it's a great combo method. I literally invented it and everything I invent is awesome. Basically what I'm saying is I'm not gonna give up. So he starts to fireball jump over close to my base and I'm a little scared, okay? Cause he kinda, he kinda wrecked me last time. So I'm going in to fight him. I throw my bed bug. I completely miss again. I like have the worst aim ever. So what do I do? I gotta build up. He's so low. I gotta get my revenge. I'm not gonna let a guy kill me and then get that low and kill me again. Um, so I, I leave because like I said, I don't want to die twice in a row to this guy. That'd be embarrassing So I run back to get geared after getting healed up and giving myself a pep talk I decided to go back out and fight this guy again uh, As you can see he tried to fireball me. I dodged it because I'm the best player in the game Like I said before at this point this guy starts running away. He knows that I'm angry He knows I'm out for blood. He knows I'm using insects named after fish as my weapon But it was at this point when I gained the advantage Gray broke white bed. Now that white is the final, he retreats. I jump, and in a leap of glory, I do it. The impossible. I hit him with my silverfish, and I feel amazing. Also, gray bed was like right there, so now it's like just me and gray left. I see where he is, and I go to fight him. Um, but then I realize he's really close to my bed. That's not good. And then he breaks my bed, which really wasn't good. It was time. The final battle to see who would win. The battle seemed to start so fast, but as it went on, time slowed, and I realized I was on half a heart. Was this really how it was supposed to end? With me being so close to using my silverfish to bring me victory, was it really going to end this quick? Of course not, I already told you I'm the best in the game, but something doesn't sit right. I feel like I was too far away to actually land a hit on him, so how did he die if it wasn't me? Spoiler alert, it was the silverfish. My silverfish got the final kill. What? This was kind of a different video than I'm usually used to making, so if you enjoyed, please subscribe and like. This took me a lot of time. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to continue this style of content, but it's something new that I thought I'd try out. Thanks everyone, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.